Hello YouTube. Uh, I'm going to get some stuff ready because I'm an ill-prepared vlogger. And I am going to read you something funny. And if you know me and um, have been listening to me speak a lot, I am from Nebraska. I was originally born in Boston, Massachusetts. But by the five, age, age, age of five, I moved back to I moved to Nebraska, and here is how I can tell I'm from Nebraska. I found this on a site, and I thought it's pretty darn funny. Um, this is just a joke. Um, I thought, you know, the government shut down. We need some funny jokes, um, especially for us Midwestern girls, to keep us sane. And yeah. You might be Nebraska if the following. Number one, you have never met any celebrities. Number two, your idea of a traffic jam is 10 cars waiting for a, waiting to pass a tractor on the highway. Number three, your idea of vacation means driving to the Henry Dorley Zoo going to the state fair. You've seen all the biggest bands ten years after they were popular. You measure in minutes. Down south means Kansas. To you means Kansas. You, number seven, you've known several people who have hit a deer. Number eight, you have no problem spelling or pronouncing Carney and Orbe and Beatrice. Number nine, you know that the answer to this, is this heaven? Number ten, your school classes were canceled because of snow. N number 11, your school classes were canceled because of heat. Number 12, you know who the Huskers are. Number 13, you have ridden a the school bus for an hour each way. Number 14, you've had to switch from heat to AC in the same day. Number 15, you think ethanol makes better, makes your truck run better. Number 16, you know what? Niha by 4th of July means refers to number 17. Your stores don't got have bags, huh? They have sacks. Number 18. You see a car running in the parking lot in a store. No matter what time of the year it is. Number 19. Your sentence ends with unnecessary preposition. For example, where's my coat where, where, where's my coat at? Or if you if you go to the mall, I want to go with. You can locate Nebraska on on the United States map. I don't think you have to be in Nebraska to do that. Um Detasseling was your first job, number 21. No, it was not. Number 22. Your idea of a great burger is when the meat is twice as big as the bun, accompanied by only ketchup and a dill pickle slice. Yeah, that's pretty good. It sounds like a good thing. Added by cheese. 23. You're, you install security lights on your house and garage and leave them both unlocked. Mm, guilty. 
you think of the four major groups as pork, beef, beer, jello, with marshmallows. Um, actually, no, I don't. I don't even like jello with marshmallows. I know a lot of people from Nebraska do, but Nebraska do, but I don't. I don't. It's called ambrosia, I think. Number twenty-five. When you're asked how, we, when you are asked how a trip is was to anywhere foreign, exotic, you say it was different. Yeah, guilty. Do you car carry jumper cables in your car? Guilty. You drink pop. Actually, I drink soda pop. My dad's from Boston, and my mom's from New Hampshire, so I drink soda pop. Number 28. You know that what the numbers 180, 275, and 2 mean. You know what cow tipping is. Actually, I still don't. You know what runza is. Damn it, all right. Good meal. I'm gonna add this. You know that Dorothy Lynch is good on everything, and I mean everything. Um, and I guess this is my last video because it's getting late and it's time for me to go hit the hay. Even though I'm still in Oregon, <laughs> not in Nebraska. I just thought this would be funny because, like, um, everybody is getting so serious. That made me a funny, funny Nebraska video. Libby made a funny. I might make another video like this tomorrow, but I, I'm losing cow time. Um, the Huskers on TV. I think I have it on DVR actually. Bye. Bye bye.